hi everyone and welcome to this video in the preview session we have seen how to rename a table in square server and we have seen that there is no direct statement that you can use like in oracle for example alter table rename to instead of that you need to use the stored procedure sp rename in this video we will see how to rename a column and constraint and index and sequence in the same way so let's get started so at first we will see how to rename a column inside a table first let us do this small sitting i'm just changing i'm just uh, telling the session to execute all these command or the coming command as this user this allow me to avoid to add the prefix to to my objects so for example select from my user table whatever so i'm just i can remove this and it will works let us create one table create table dummy table one id is an int name varkar two uh, varkar 30 so table has been created let's do select and now we want to rename this column name for example so for that we will use this stored procedure rename and you provide the table name name and the second parameter is just the new name name new for example let's run it and select and you see it works let's do the same for constraint for that i will create a constraint on on this table i will add a check constraint on this table just to check with this name my constraint and to check the length of the name should be greater than five less created has been created you can check select from schemata constraint check constraint you can check the name here and again so this is the name and again you can you can rename it using the stored procedure and you have only to define this is and you see like this because the constraint the namespace of the constraint is the same as the table let's see and it works so if we check here we will see that the constraint has been renamed we can do the same for indexes for example let's create an index on this table on name for example create index my index on on this table and you specify the index Na uh, because we have a new name index has been uh, created so you can check the indexes in in sys these indexes and you see this is my index index my index is here so to rename this index you can use this again this stored procedure procedure and you have only to specify the the index name however index belongs uh, the parent object of index is this table so you have to add the table as prefix and you can give the new name 
and you see it works and you can also check again in in the sys uh, sys indexes here it it has been renamed you can do the same for sequences let's create create a dummy sequence sequences sec test one increment it doesn't matter the other configuration increment by and you can see the sequence select from sys sequences and again using this stored procedure you don't need to specify the type so i'm not sure whether this is a good idea from square server it is unlike unlike to unlike to oracle for example and you have only to specify the new name so the old name and the new name and it works so we have only one one function or pro uh, stored procedure that can be used to rename almost all objects inside a database so thank you for watching and bye